Hello everyone, welcome again to another GT7 track guide. I'm Angel. Today we have Deep Forest, which is an original Gran Turismo track. So yeah, this is quite complex. This track is quite complex. So yeah, I hope this really can help you. So let's get into it. Okay, so turn one is exactly at this point. Well, where, where the wall ends you have to brake, okay? A straight line braking. Try to keep, try to stay on the inside as much as you can, extending the, the trail braking. And then at this point, you start accelerating really, really slowly. Otherwise, the car will try to spin, you know? And and as I, as I said on the, prev on the previous video, um, the throttle here in this game is really, really hard to get. It's a lot harder than on GT Sport. And then here, try to use all the track as, as much as possible. And then here, you start turning in at this point, okay? And then try to go just over this curve. Maybe just touching a little bit the, 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 the grass, but just a little bit, otherwise the, you, the car will be unstable at the exit. And then, this is probably the most tricky one. Um, start braking at this point, trail braking through the entire corner. Don't touch these red sausages, or maybe, I don't know, just a little bit. If you go completely over them, well, the, the, the car will just jump. As you can see here, I barely touched one. <laughs> so, yeah, here you carry Try, try to carry a lot of, of speed because this is an up here <laughs> the more you brake obviously the more the car slows down because of the the, the the camber of the of the of the turn so try to carry more speed than you think here and then use all the track as you can see here uh, barely touching the wall and um, on this one, you have to break um, just where, where the, the tunnel ends and uh, turn in at the same time, you know, and then trail braking and keep or stay on the inside always. You don't need to, to go a bit wide uh, to get a, a better exit. No, just uh, stick to the inside and this will be the fastest way. Just like this, and then again, barely touching the wall. And on this turn, this is a completely blind turn, so you you go just over the grass over here to get a, a wider entry into the next corner, which is this one. You keep the inside, and um, well, yeah, you try to accelerate as soon as you can because. You want to carry more speed here, open up as much as possible, and uh, you have to start braking around here. As you can see, it's, let's say it's, it depends on how good you did the, the previous turn. I mean, how, how good or how fast was your, your exit on the previous turn. So if you're going too fast, obviously, you know, you, you need to, to, to brake a little bit earlier try to, to keep always the same speed, you break exactly at the middle of this point and you try to straight breaking just a little bit as you can as you saw here and then I start turning in because what you want here is to carry speed on the apex but at the same time you want to get a really good exit so yeah because as you can see on the on the track above, there's a, a tremendous straight line. And then use all the track available, even the the, the green part. And uh, yeah, the, the the famous tunnel of deep forest. Nothing too much to say here. Okay, here you break exactly there. 
just at the, uh, at the start of the curve, a straight line breaking, obviously. This is a, a hairpin, so you need to do that. And then if you want, you can go just a little bit with the with the right um, with the right wheels over this curve, but not too much. Then you try to get a good exit here. Yes, be really careful on this. Obviously, if you miss the braking, you will miss the entire apex the entire line, everything. So the braking is the most important on this turn, precisely. And then you you use all the track available. And uh, well, this this last turns are flat out. So that would be the guide. Um, the, the, um, the sector one is probably the trickiest one, so yeah, that's gonna that's gonna be the, the 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 hardest part, but yeah, it's a pre I don't know pretty fun track to learn, a pretty hard, but yeah, it's enjoyable when when you get to know it. So yeah, I hope this can help you. And now you're gonna watch the 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 hot lap, this hot lap without any pause. So pay attention to the telemetry because this is a replay, so you 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 cannot see any of the inputs <laughs> so yeah pay attention to it and i hope this can help you And yeah, everyone, that would be all for today's guide. I hope this really can help you. It's a really enjoyable track. And yeah, see you next time on the next GT7 track guide.